I'm running low on samples of a certain origami species. Luckily, a group of them were just reported at a nearby factory. I'll be heading over there to do a little hunting. Would you care to join me? Good. Thank you. It was three years ago. I lost a friend to this place. She... She was like a little sister to me. Certainly closer than my real family. I should have saved her. Yes. They really do. Day in and day out, I am surrounded by death that I can come to terms with. But I still can't get used to her absence. Captain, do you know much of the Aegis Project? I expected as much. Aegis was to be my father's magnum opus. He was a branch director and a scientist, but he still wanted more. He lived by a simple code. The ends justify the means. I've never been able to come to terms with that. Still, as I delve deeper into his work, I have come to see that, though mad, he truly had a first-rate mind. His name appears constantly in all kinds of texts, but mostly his early work pertained to advances in construction. Yet still, despite all that renown, I... Ah, my apologies. Linda was scheduled to call. Thank you. We'll pick this up again, then. Farewell. Hmm. Perhaps a little compression here would better serve the required bias factor tuning. Still, this Aegis was built for strength. <laughs> I can see his arrogant face in every one of these walls. We didn't get to finish our talk last time, did we? Where did we leave off? Ah, of course. Well, I may not be as great a scientist as my father, but I do have much I can be proud of. I have friends who trust me implicitly, just as I trust them. I am proud to fight alongside each of them. Kota may act the fool, but he swore to protect the Far East for as long as he draws breath. Alyssa battles origami <laughs> and paperwork. Every day for the people in the satellite bases. Meanwhile, Lindo and an old friend have gone in search of new origami. Every new find helps to create a better future. There's no one right answer to life. There's always many paths before you. I know that now. I'm glad. I first heard that from a friend. When Aegis failed, my father lost his mind. When he fell, he was alone. Enemies waited in every shadow. Fanaticism like his breeds self-righteousness, which brings isolation, only furthering his fanaticism. I walked that path once. I know too well how easy it is to slip and fall. I didn't mean to talk your ear off. Let's proceed. I may have mentioned this before, but... You really do remind me of one of my old friends. I expect the same greatness of you. Is that you, Graham? I know what you're thinking, but don't kid yourself. Especially if that's an order from HQ. We don't have those kinds of resources. You want to know what's out there? Go look yourself. Ah, you're here. I wanted to apologize. I may have placed too much of my own burden on your shoulders. In any case, I made a prototype part using the QB cells. If you like, you can use it. Oh, I suppose I haven't told you that, have I? 
Almost all of the research at the Far East branch is focused on quelling the Aragami threat. Actually, this is quite the opportunity. Is there anything you'd like to know? Very well. Leave all of that element to me. In fact, we need Sakaki to focus more on his directorial tasks and less on his research. Hmm. <laughs> Did you know that humans used to be able to get to the moon? It was lost when the Aragami came. There seemed to be bigger problems. We lost almost all of the old Earth. But still, we keep fighting. Striving to take it back. We keep pushing, one small step at a time, against the tide. We can make a better future. Come on, let's keep going. Nothing. Nothing at all. Let's go. 